Hey guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4. Let's go ahead and jump right back into the Monat household. Alrighty guys, and welcome back to some more Sims 4 gameplay. So I did get a little festive, because, you know, I love the holidays, and I decorated the house just a little bit, nothing too crazy. We also have some festive holiday music playing right now. And um, for the house remodeling, I think I'm going to do that in the next part because I kind of just wanted to put down some holiday decor for now. Also, I'm going to go ahead and have Candace put on her everyday wear number uno. And you can see she is now wearing a nice little festive sweater. Everybody in the household, of course, except Taylor, who is a child and doesn't receive any, will have ugly sweaters on for the holidays. And I'm going to keep it this way until the holidays are over. So we're going to go ahead and roll out in there for some, some oh. Uh, move objects on is finally here. We're gonna go and throw that in there. That's what I wanted to do. And Candace actually heads to work in 35 minutes. And I also decorated a little bit up here as well. I gave Taylor, or not Taylor, but Megan kind of a nice little get up in here. I think for her room, I'm gonna go for a very classic, kind of, sort of, vintage theme. And um, this is actually Nadine's like little computer that she earned as a reward. So um, that's pretty cool looking. And then other than that, I don't think I did anything. Oh, I added an easel, because we will be using that. I'm gonna have Jose go ahead and wake up now come down here and he is going to ooh, we can upgrade it reinforce door hmm i mean our fridge doesn't break very often but we're gonna go ahead and actually we're not gonna cook we're gonna open this really quickly and we have some pancakes yes we're gonna go ahead and grab a serving of pancakes and then i do want to head out here oh C candace um go to work Okay, this little old woman is literally using this huge machine. But yep, she's off to work, and look at her doing her little suave walk. So suave. And Jose is going to eat his pancakes and then go outside and study those plant microscope or whatever, microscopic studies, whatever you want to call it, so we can actually gain a picture from that. And it's actually pretty cool looking, by the way. Eat your freaking pancakes. Shove those pancakes in your mouth, Jose. Eat them. And have a good time. Um, actually, funny story. I um, I was just, you know, doing all of their ugly sweaters and decorating. And my living room caught on fire. And <laughs> the first thing that caught on fire was the voodoo doll. And I put it out. But I was like, okay, Cassandra Goth. Okay. She's like, you wanted to mess with me? Fine. I'm wrathing from the pits of hell to burn your house down. I was like, Cassandra, please. Okay, that's going to get a little annoying. Where did that go? Where did that go? Okay, but, oh, are you freaking kidding me? No, my holiday music. I'm just going to go ahead and replace it. That's the perks of having money in this game. And we're going to come out here and analyze a plant sample. Because, I mean, why not? It's going to look pretty in the house, and I'm excited. Oh, don't mind that, okay? Don't mind that at all. So let's go ahead and fast forward through this. Okay, a print of his discovery has been added to his inventory. So let's go ahead and take a little look-see. And here it is. Here's the picture. It is the plants from out front. And, I mean, it doesn't really look good there. It actually looks kind of horrible there. And I don't have anywhere I want to put it right now. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is just throw it in my inventory. I mean, it is pretty, but just right now I can't really, can't really do it. So we're going to actually head out here and harvest our plants as well. Okay, that's good. And I also noticed since we got the patch, his work requirements have changed a little bit. He now needs to reach level two of the rocket science, um, <clears throat> of the rocket science skill and reach level eight of the okay, fitness. So we are going to purchase rocket science volume one. So you want to be a rocket scientist. Yeah, totally. And when does he go to work? In 56 minutes, so he's not really going to be able to read it today. But the kids are now home from school, and Josh is getting a call. The principal is calling. Uh-oh. <laughs> is the principal going to be like, listen, you smelled horrible today. Please shower. The principal is calling to say that my school performance is pretty shaky. Okay, okay, Mr. Principal, I know, okay? Okay, so I love how Josh and Megan, oh my gosh, who's calling now? 
Um, Duan Goff. Uh, he would like to come over and hang out. Sure, we need friends. I also added in some of your lovely Sims, but I'm gonna be posting like a whole little introduction to them before I reveal who they are. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and invite Mr. Duan. Is he a teenager? I don't know. I can't tell. Let me look. He is a teenager. So actually, Josh, go ahead and introduce yourself to him. He did look like a teenager, but those shoes, though, so couture. And we, we have a floating plate right here. <laughs> okay. I do have move objects on right now, so you guys might see floating objects. Just a warning. As it is the newest cheat, I did use it. Okay. So we're going to kind of just mess with him a little bit. Why not? Joke about toilets, because that is so funny. We're going to flash him crazy eyes, because Josh is crazy. Barbie and apparently very dirty very very dirty okay so he's gonna do his thing and Megan okay good girl she's showering up she didn't really smell all that good and a daily task homework not started okay we are going to go ahead and no that's grade school we need this one right here or primary we needed grade school right I think that's it we're gonna go ahead and turn on our candles as well and Taylor is going to mold something new with her free time. Oh, actually, she just oh she just molded that bunny. Go ahead and put it down. Put it down. Actually, I'm gonna have Taylor head upstairs and continue drawing her shapes because I do want her to get a pretty good creativity skill. Yes, draw two pictures while inspired. So she's gonna go do that. Megan, Megan, Megan. Uh, she wants to listen to music for two hours, but she needs to do that first. And actually, I really should have Taylor do her homework, shouldn't I? Probably. <laughs> actually, Taylor, come down here and be a good little sim. And come do your homework down here with your, with your aunt. How crazy is that tag? Now you're it, Josh. Please stop. Please stop. And what do you need to do today, buddy? He's gonna, where's your homework? Does he not have one? Okay, well, really quickly, we're gonna order him a voodoo doll. No, we're gonna purchase him a book. And of course, it's going to be some homework as it is needed. So go do your homework. Uh, Nadine is home. Oh, and I did give Nadine like a new hair. And I'm, it's my first custom content hair that I'm actually using in my LPs. And I think it looks really good. I'm really picky on custom content hair. I need something that's a balance between, um, like, it needs to look like it's supposed to be in the game. It's the best way I can put it. It needs to look like it belongs in my game, and I'll like it. If it doesn't, I'm just like, eh. You know what I mean? I'm, I, I'm not really a big fan of it. Um, but the kids are going to go ahead and do their homework. And Josh, Josh, go do your homework. Go do it. Okay, and Megan, you really should do, like, what the hell? All right, true. Guys, Megan, Megan, what are you doing? Do you need me to move the book for you, or are you going to do it like that? I mean, um, okay, that was scary. <laughs> um, oh, and Candace is now home from work, and I'm going to have her. Is she in a good mood? Yes, she's actually in a fantastic mood. I'm going to have her begin to paint. We're going to start off with a small painting. And to tell you guys the truth, painting in this game, it's really nice. You get you get some nice paintings, and um, there's so many paintings to choose from as you, you know, improve your skill. There's literally such an array of paintings. So I'm excited for that. Okay. Oh. How cute. And I think I'm going to have Drake go ahead and serve dinner tonight for a change. He'll make some fish tacos. Look at, look at Megan. She's like, please, stop. <laughs> oh, and her and Dwan actually get along pretty well. But I'm going to have her come over here and play her violin. Do her thing. Josh, are you doing your homework? Oh, he's in a horrible mood. Funny toy. On a roll. He's an actually, he's very playful right now, which is not surprising. But he's going to go uh, use the toilet after he's done with that. Then he will take a shower and eat dinner as well. Drake, are you not going to cook? 
I asked you to cook. Can you please go make some fish tacos? Alright, and let's see. Is Mekin doing good or, or, or horrible? Oh, she's doing okay. Just okay. Oh, and that's actually really, really cute. I love it. Look how cute the painting is. It's like a little, it's a little llama. Oh, it's cute. Okay, I am going to put it in Little Miss, um, Ta okay, true, where am I? Little Miss Taylor's room. We will put it right there, and I'm not going to frame it either. I just think it looks really cute. And she's going to use the upstairs shower. Yes, use up, use it up here because Josh is gonna go shower in a second, and um, <laughs> look at Drake over here cooking for everyone. I think I'm gonna have Drake and Nadine go out to the club tonight, get turned up. Yeah, guys, turned up. That's right. T U R N T turned. Why not? And magically, fish tacos were made. We're gonna call it a meal. So hopefully, hopefully, whoever is hungry will come eat. He's gonna go shower. All right, Megan, you can come eat as well. Jose is at work for a little bit longer. We're gonna go ahead and do that. So yeah, everybody's gonna come eat. I'll go ahead and move really quickly because I do want everybody to really, okay. I need to turn this cheat off because I feel, I don't know where they're going. Where the hell are these plates going? I'll move them here for now. I'll do that off camera. I'll go ahead and put the kids' homework in their inventory. Move this book in Nadine's inventory, I guess, so everybody can eat at the at the dinner table. All right, Drake, are you gonna grab yourself a plate? Did you already eat? He might have. Yeah, I think he did. Go ahead and eat. Megan, eat your food. Everybody's eating. Eat. Okay. Good. 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 He's gonna go grab his plate now. He's a little late, but why are these going off? Turn this back on. Okay, Megan. Okay, chill out. Chill. I know, but you need to chill out. There's no need to scream at the dinner table. Thank you. Sincerely, everybody. And Nadine is going to. She still has a bit of energy. She's a little tired, but I'm gonna have her. Hmm. Daily task, write books. <laughs> um, I guess she will go write a book. We will write a genre book, a motivational book, since she's feeling confident again. It might just be her her good subject or her good genre. Not subject, her good genre. So she'll, uh, come on, um, we're going to name this How to Ensure All Eyes Are On. R R. This is our great book. How to ensure all eyes are off, yo man. Yes, this is a confident book. All right, so she's gonna start writing that. We just won't tell Drake about it. I guess he's off to bed. Well, actually, buddy, you need to work on your logic skill. So we're gonna go play some cards. Okay, we're going to play cards tonight. We'll play it with Candace, I guess, since she's not doing anything. <laughs> or she was, but I, I made her stop. And Megan is doing the dishes. Good for her. Ooh, soothing strings from violin music. A perfectly soft violin melody can make remarkably, or be remarkably smooth. Blah, blah, blah. We're going to go ahead and continue to practice. And Taylor is taking a, a bubble bath and that tub needs to be scrubbed and I did want oh my gosh it sounded like somebody farted I did want them to go out tonight but it's a Monday night we go to the club on a Tuesday guys <laughs> I know I hate myself for saying that too um so yeah they're just gonna improve their logic skill and then he's gonna go to bed and when is Jose gonna get home my lordy he's been out all day Alright, Candace improved her logic skill. Now to just wait. For no, Drake. Drake. Sit your little freaking butt down. No, we're not playing Nadine. And play Candace for a little bit long. I was going to scream at him so hard. Finish. You've got to finish this. Because we are rather close to getting a promotion. And you're going to do this. You have work in eight hours. You can go to sleep. And you can sleep all the way until you leave. 
No, Drake, sit, sit down right now. Sit, sit down and finish. There you go. Now you can go to bed, buddy. <laughs> okay. All right. Yes. Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. Yes. Get it, Megan. Get it, hunty. I love it. Okay. Now she needs to go acapado. So she's going to go do that. She's going to go to sleep. Taylor is in bed. Where's Nadine? Sleep. Drake is going to sleep as well. This one's focused on the toilet. <laughs> Bidet made, of course. Go ahead and clean that for me. Alright. And when do you go to work? If four days. Okay. You can go ahead and stay up for a while. Oh. A mathematical diagram. Alright, I guess we'll go we'll go do that since we're feeling focused from playing cards. Um, not quite sure how this is gonna look, but let's hope it looks really well. I feel bad for Megan. <laughs> Imagine being in like in the middle of sleep and your mother just stomping through your room to go to go sketch out a design. Oh, I would flip. I would flip. But yeah, she's gonna go ahead and do that. And because she did complete her, you know, cooking skill and her gourmet cooking skill, there's really nothing other than I guess painting that I would want her to do right now. Like Jose is taking up, you know, woods wood crafting. So I thought painting would be nice. It would be fun and of course you all know I've been wanting to do it and I'm gonna have Taylor I guess follow in her grandmother's footsteps and complete it as well. Sorry if you guys hear my dogs barking. They I, I think they hate me or something because every time I film they're like, you know you guys don't even know. I have to like stop filming like ten times every time I film because of them. Like, I need to right now, but, um, I think I'd rather complain. <laughs> yeah, it's looking pretty cool. I think this would actually look really nice in Megan's room. Because the room's, like, very red, and I think, like, a nice off-contrasting blue would, would look nice. So we're gonna actually put that in her room. Would it look nice in here? I think it really would. Maybe even, you know what? Drake, you just got lucky. Okay, true. I wish they would fix this. This would look way better if it was bigger, so... I guess, I guess we'll just do this for now, okay? Uh, we will put it, I guess, like, ugh, it doesn't look right. Above his door, no. We'll put it there for now, even though I need to definitely paint more of them. Can you make a couple more for me? Making her stay up all night, but I'd really appreciate if we could get more of those. And when you create like confident pictures or um of course you know focused you can enable emotional <laughs> enable emotional aura and it will you know your sims will go in the room and they'll get nice and focused or nice and confident and all of that good Rona stuff Derby! all right chill out chill out we get it you're happy that you went to the bathroom good for you did we need to know no I'm gonna have her go ahead and brush her teeth, just to brush her teeth. All right, and then because it's 5 a.m., I'm gonna have her, I guess, resume crafting a little bit in here. All right, I, you know, it's honestly so weird, the noises that they make. Oh, she finished it, good for you, and you can go to sleep now. When they're sleeping, it's like all of them are talking to each other. See, you hear this? Why? Why game? Why? Josh is awake. He's going to go downstairs and watch some kids network. Or actually, this is how it would go down. He's going to go make himself a bowl of cereal and then go watch some cartoons while eating his cereal. There you go. Okay, what is she doing up here? Oh, she's talking to Blarfy. Okay, go ahead and hug him. She's like, yes! This feels so good! <laughs> we'll go ahead and put that in her inventory. And she needs to eat before she goes to school. So she will have a quick thing of cereal as well. You know, I never really looked at the little kids opening the fridge. Is that weird? That that like, I'm like, oh my gosh. I can't believe I haven't looked. I need to look. Yeah, I'm a weird one. And Megan's gonna go ahead and wake up because she needs to eat as well. She will have some cereal. Look at them watching the 
<laughs> Watching little kids cartoons together. It's so cute. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay. So really quickly, quit poking me. Okay. Okay. Then. Okay. I wish there was a way we could actually like make those toys real people and then, you know, <laughs> Josh could date whoever. That would really be great. Like an imaginary friend. I would let Josh have an imaginary friend. Cause I don't, I, like, he talks to his friends. Like let me make Blarfy or somebody or Drago real needs to happen. All right, that will work for now. So it will work for now. Okay. And I think I'm going to be ending this part soon. And I'm actually going to probably film another part right after this. So the, ho the, the, the house renovations will probably not come for like the next two parts or so. Or after, I don't know, soon. Soon, guys. That's all I can say. Soon. And the kids are actually off to school. Okay. Oh, look how cute she looks. Look how cute she is. I love her. <laughs> And I also need Jose to come over here and water these because they are not looking good. Like, at all. Let's go ahead and water those for me. Alright. And then, oh, threat report. Drake's got a big report on a new emerging threat due tomorrow at work. But he's swamped. You can either ask secretly for help from another researcher or work all night to get it done. You work all night. Oh, performance loss small. Okay, never mind. Never mind. And, no, didn't need to do that. Okay. I'm going to have him... Let's see, can we melt anything? Nah. We're going to come back here and work on our wood crafting. We will make... Ooh. Ooh. We've pretty much made all of these, so we'll go craft a bar stool. Also... Um, I don't know if you guys keep up with Sim News, but in case you don't, I floating plate, okay? I will go ahead and inform you guys that there's actually a DLC game pack coming for The Sims 4, which it is called Outdoors Retreat, and I will definitely be purchasing it and doing an overview on it the day it comes out, because I have been doing that with all stuff packs, expansion packs, <laughs> a lot of store content for a while now, because I, for one, um... You know, prior to making them, I would watch, like, the reviews and everything because you don't want to spend your money on something you just would not use. Especially if you're... Oh. Um. What was... Th was that because we got bills? Okay. But like I was saying, um... We're going to go ahead and hide out in Taylor's PE class. Okay. Anyways, like I was saying... You know, I for one would not want to spend money on something I just would not use. So, I mean, I'd buy it because I collect them. Um, <clears throat> I have like a man's voice right now. I apologize. I, I buy them because I collect like the Sims. It's like the th thing I collect, I guess. So, um, I'll no matter what pretty much purchase them. But I know some people aren't like that and they would just rather see a review and purchase the things they like so i will be doing that and nine times out of ten i will gift them out but i'm not quite sure i'll do like a little giveaway i'm just not quite sure how origin works quite yet because I, I i use steam more than origin so i will have to see if that is possible i really hope so um so yeah also i i do do a lot of giveaways on my twitter I'm just like informing you guys because I know a lot of you guys don't have The Sims 4 yet. I do do them quite often. Uh, Sims 3, stuff packs, expansion packs, all of that, store content. I would give them out because I have leftover points and stuff and I'm like, whatever. I'll just give them, you know, a chance to win some. And Sims 4, sometimes I'll see them at Target and I'll just pick one up and be like, all right, I'll give one away. Why not? So I would just, you know, you never know. You never know if you'll win. You never know. So yeah, he's just gonna be doing this. What is this? Bribery? Take the bribe. I don't know. Um, we lost 50 smillions. Cool. Cool. Why did we gain it? I don't know. Alright, so let's go ahead and take a look at our stool. It's in our household inventory. Here it is. Let's take a look at this little stool he crafted. It's not horrible. Definitely not horrible. It's not like the most amazing stool, but I mean... Oh, it's only in one color? Okay, then. 
We could sell it for 60 simoleons, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that. And I think I am going to go ahead and end this part here. Um, I wish, I wish, I wish, I wish upon a star. Makes no difference who you are. Oh, nope, didn't mean to do that. I'm gonna go dig for treasure really quickly before we end this part and hopefully we'll get a missing trophy because I really want like the pizza guy. I want him so bad. Let's go ahead and open this. And who did I get? Violet. Do you know how many effing Violets I have? Goodbye, Violet. Goodbye. Okay, guys. So I am going to end this part here. Don't forget to give this video a big fat fatty flick fatties. Um, thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if you would like. Yeah. I love you all. Okay? Bye. <laughs>